Καλησπέρα σα, καλοί φίλοι τηλεθεατέ. Καλώ ορίσατε. Good evening, welcome to Faces again. A new face to me, obviously to you as well. I have with me Mr. Yezid Jimenez. Jimenez? Jimenez. Jimenez. Yeah. Sorry about that, you know, it's uh, my <laughs> accent. I'm Greek. And That's okay. <laughs> welcome. You pronounce it well. Thank you for the invitation. Uh, yeah, Yezid Jimenez, as you say. You're welcome. Thank yes. you very Where much you for from? having me here. Uh, I, I'm born in, I was born in Colombia mm -hmm. and, and I, I've been living in the UK for the last seven years. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I just went out to chase my dream and that's why I'm here. Okay. Yeah. Uh, would you like to give us more information about yourself? I mean, you say you're born in uh, Colombia. Yeah. You studied I, there? You, I you, basically, uh, yeah. I was you born have in your Columbia. school days there and all of this? University. School time, yeah, university, and then I I joined uh, a radio station and a TV station afterwards. So one in Colombia, thing, in Colombia, uh -huh. one thing helped to to get the other, mm -hmm. and eventually I was uh, deep into the the business, like I, like taking a lot of uh, um, experience mm -hmm. uh, because. I was doing a, a bit of everything, you know, to start like a runner and mm -hmm. things like that. But I always uh, dreamed about the idea of making films, mm -hmm. and that was possibly my my begin my my start to that. So I knew that some way I would be able to to start uh, in this business. And yes, I I grew up uh, with a family, uh, three uh, two brothers, one sister, so we are four and my parents and yeah we live a, a very unique uh, life because like as, as it is in latin america you know like you need families so after that i decided to move out and i i went to quito ecuador mm -hmm. which is one country uh, that is uh, smaller than colombia it's next to Equ to colombia mm -hmm. and i i lived there for five five years and i also did work, some work on television, mm -hmm. and I did some work on radio, yes. one one of the biggest radios in in Ecuador. So I was Ecuador, yes. Ecuador, Ecuador yeah. yes. So I so was very, uh, very, very um, enthusiastic about following this thing mm -hmm. further until I had the opportunity to come to London. When did you come to London? I came uh, at the end of 2005, huh? and uh, that was uh, thanks to uh, obviously my my ambitions to to be here and and help of friends who actually support me. And once I was here, it was just a matter of uh, getting the English and starting to work and starting to get the the culture and. And I fell in love with it, you know, with everything. Mm -hmm. So I had a, a good start, and it was it was before university, obviously. Before university. Yeah, which I I, I did in in the UK. Uh huh. Uh, I graduated in media from the University of Westminster. Okay. Yeah, I studied in Harrow, Harrow, and next to Harrow on the Hill. I don't know if you are familiar. Yes. Yeah. I know the place. And then what's happened? Uh, I mean, how you? get involved in this um, uh, production company, which uh, you are now, and that's the reason you're here today. today. You wanna, we're going to talk about your um, uh, production and your uh, first film, which yes, is coming out uh, the release, today, actually. Which is today, exactly. Yes. Okay, we're going to talk about the releasing of the film a, li a, bit, late, a bit later on. No Give me a little bit of information about the company, uh, which uh, you formed with other friends. Yes. This company started uh, obviously. Fantastica. Fantastica which pictures. Which is Fantastica in yeah. Greek, actually. Uh, from Fantasia, you know, imagination. Mm, exactly. You know I mean? yes. Yeah. I, I liked the idea of Disney World, you know. Uh -huh. I, I thought that it could be possible to, to make another world, but obviously I'm not. A Fantastica world. I, yes. yes I, so something on the positive side, something mm -hmm. that is very positive and where you can create. Mm -hmm. And that's how Fantastica starts, you know. How you met uh, the others, you know. Uh, friends uh, ago, uh, I was friend with Michael Gruber, uh -huh. who is a, a, a friend of my wife, 
uh-huh. and they they know for, they, they're known to each other for a few years. So then I started to to obviously communicate to people about my idea of producing films, uh-huh. uh, one film specifically, and then he he got attracted to it, and then Michael introduced me to Costas Joano, okay, who has has been like. A little bit of a father these days because he is very advisable and all this stuff. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. So we got together and and we decided to take this into to materialize Fantastica Pictures into something that could um, like a company that will make f- uh, films, mm-hmm. entertainment, uh, but it, it's not limited to that. So we are uh, starting with uh, the release of a feature film. But Fantastica Pictures, as the name says, is fantastic. Yes. So you are four at the moment in the company, yes? Yes. Is it you, your yeah, wife, mm-hmm. and uh, these are the gentlemen? Yes. And yeah. the Costas uh, Ioano? Costas Ioano. Any yeah. more to come in? Uh, you Who is the chairman? Um, we, we have uh, uh, very good um, uh, things uh, for the company. Mm-hmm. And we have started recently, and and I think with with this team we are going to get far because everybody has ideas and everybody has expertise in different areas, mm-hmm. which is key for for this, mm-hmm. which is not easier because a company. So uh, when you came all together and formed the company, yes. Um, Obviously, you are the guy who knows about it. You study the business and all this kind of thing. So you all decided that you gonna write the script for, uh, for the film. Where the idea came from, from uh, about the, you know, yeah. the story of the film. Uh, well, I've and been, what is all about? Give us more information about the script. Okay, I've been writing since uh, way back. Mm-hmm. So uh, it all started because um, because I had this film, this project uh, going on. Mm-hmm. And, and it was it was uh, a really good thing to to, to work have on people it. involved uh-huh. to work on it mm-hmm. and to make as I said to materialize uh, this project into a company to something okay. so I started to write uh, since uh, since 2009 probably but I always had ideas mm-hmm. of stories so I started to uh, just get involved with writing and, and writing at home. My wife is witness that I I start writing and I start laughing uh, to myself of the things that I write, yeah. which I find is this, like, interesting. Uh, is this storytelling. Um, film has comedy in it? Uh, it has some bits of black comedy, uh-huh. but it's a psychological thriller. Uh-huh. So it's going to be something, uh, a, a story um, that takes you to somewhere um, but is instead of mystery, there is a lot of um, uh, unexpected things mm-hmm. uh, happening, which is interesting. And obviously, uh, each character has his own um, their own um, uh, problems and situations. So it's a story that mm-hmm. takes you from A to Z, but not before going through a maze, which is the the. the the, f- the good part of, on, of mm-hmm. it. So you wrote the script yes. and uh, produce and direct as well, yeah. yes? This film, um, which is called Play With Me, uh, I wrote it with the idea of producing it as an as experiment. Uh-huh. Because producing a film could be easier if you have uh, uh, the means to do it. But if you don't, you still can do it. And then you start with the writing, mm-hmm. so I said I want to write a, a feature film. Uh, by the way, this is my uh, debut film. Um, so I said I, I just need to get down on paper and write a story that covers possibly from 90 to 100 pages. And since I've, I've been having good ideas and and notes everywhere about uh, the characters and, and things that I would like to see on the screen. Then I start to put it down and, mm-hmm. and then it starts to, to get to get a shape. So this is my second feature film script. But then um, my first one is called Door 10 and it's going to be the second film to be produced. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so after I finished Door 10, I started writing Play With Me, which was first yeah, produced. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but I keep writing. I, I have other writing going on, so I, I write almost every day. 
which is good. Mm -hmm. uh, but Play With Me uh, started as an experiment. I decided that I would like to, uh, that I had to shoot this film in two days, which was a challenge. Mm. And, I, and also I wanted to use people who were now um, completely experts about the, the, the making of a film. So I have a lot of um, rejects. For, I interview about 100 people for the roles and they all say that it will now be possible to shoot in two days. But as I say, it, it, it was an experiment that is turned into a feature yeah. film. How many actors do you use? You have quite a few people? Uh, yes, I it? had six, and th this was also different. I had six main actors and only one supporting actor. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you have one main and six supporting, but this one has, it was the opposite. Mm -hmm. So there's one actor uh, who was playing the role of a doctor who had a very small character, but still interesting. And the other ones uh, were the main ones, so it, it was it's like um, a love triangle. Um, uh, a couple comes from Spain to London mm -hmm. uh, with um, the, one of the uh, the guys uh, um, as a violinist, and he wants to get to perform in London, so he might become in in, in a, a very famous, very good uh, musician in London. But that's Thanks to a, a, a friend of his, which was an ex-lover that he met in Spain. So he comes with his girlfriend. Mm -hmm. and, and when they met in the house, everything happens in the house. It's one location. It's when everything starts to, to revolve, you know. You mean the whole film is in one location, in the house? It's, it's one location, uh -huh. yeah. In order to and the characters are all together, they meet together. All together, mm -hmm. yes. So mm -hmm. Everything, all the situations happen in one house. Okay. Uh, you Latin. haven't got any uh, outside uh, locations? Uh, no, it's just the introduction mm -hmm. of the film, which is mm -hmm. uh, the London, you know, landmarks. Mm -hmm. uh, but all the rest is happening in the house. Okay, how long is the film? It's 90 minutes. 90 minutes, yeah, yeah official film. It's a okay, feature film. Uh, how about the cost? I mean, was it a low, very low budget, or what money uh, you use? This will be categorized as a micro low budget, something like that. So low budget is still a lot of money, but this film had uh, lower money than that, but enough to, to make it possible, you know. So I know, I mean, even if you haven't got any penny, and if everybody works uh, for nothing, you can make a film, but you know, you need a bit of money to uh, do yeah. the editing or this kind of thing. Mm. I mean, no, it's still how about the editing? I mean, did yeah, you I had, I had different people to, uh, or you did that? Did I, I did it. Obviously, I have my my own facilities, mm -hmm. and I invested. Uh, and you use your own cameras, and all this? That, and I and I had my cameras, but then I, because I have some fun uh, fans. Uh, in the process, I got involved with uh, Costa Joano and Michael mm -hmm. Grover, mm -hmm. so we um, we kind of. Uh, uh, put some funds towards the, the production to, to make it, to complete it. Mm -hmm. And and that was that got even better, you know. So mm -hmm. we have some things and we got the other things necessary for the film. Mm -hmm. Give us more information about the story. I mean, you know, just uh, to let us uh, know how the story is uh, progressing. Okay, the story is, is basically about uh, this violinist that um, that is is in London to pursue a dream as a musician, mm -hmm. uh, but then everything changes slightly once in the house mm -hmm. uh, because of the relation they had before. So the girlfriend is not only coming to see him or to make company to him, but she is also pursuing something else. She has other dreams. She has other. Um, interest mm -hmm. uh, on this trip to London. Mm -hmm. And because the house where they stay in is a friend of uh, the violinist's uh, ex-lover. Oh. It's like a, a relation. So they met at some point in Spain. Mm -hmm. That's how they, they got to know each other. And they are meeting again in London. So it's going to be, it's like, um, uh, um, as I say, it's a love triangle, but it takes different forms because of the situation. For instance, 
one, uh, the guy is looking, uh, is after the lady, and then this this other guy is looking at, uh, is after the other lady. Uh -huh. So it's a it's, it's like a, a mixed up. Yeah. Once um, everything seems to to be um, coming to uh, uh, like a, a, a final part. It's when things uh, ha change. Something else happened. So the, you know, the film the has a big twist, mm -hmm. and it has to uh, to do with the mother of um, of the the girlfriend of the violinist who is coming to London mm -hmm. to find some answers in regards to what happened to them when they met in Spain. Mm -hmm. So everything has a twist. Imagine yeah. you are here today discussing yeah. with your friends. And you think that you are fixing all your problems, mm -hmm. and then suddenly you something have somebody coming in yes. to do something completely different to the story and create more problems and. And that's or, how that's how um, interested this yeah. is. That's how I recommend to people uh, to watch the film, obviously, because uh, one thing is to say yeah, six characters and 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 all the rest, but the other thing is to experience mm -hmm. the actual uh, ninety minutes, which is. The, what, what the film is about. So it's, mm -hmm. a, it's a very uh, interesting thing. Something that has been known as uh, different, because I'm a Latin American, mm -hmm. I'm making a, a film in the UK with people from about 11 nationalities. So it's not only a Colombian guy making a film, it's, it's a lot of, it's a contribution for, from people from different, different cultures parts, in all these countries. Which is interesting and that's how I, I got in love mm -hmm. with this place because you, you don't get that in other places. In, if I want to shoot a film in Colombia and if I want a person from a different nationality, I have to you hunt for them. this person. Yes. Here is so, different. That's good, interesting, yeah. very interesting. So the film is out today, yes? Mm -hmm. Okay, and how can anyone watch it? Um, that's the best After part. After when we finish, because you yeah. know, I mean, they're watching us now. You have so, to, yes. you have to watch as well. Yes. Um, the film. Watch us first, and then you <laughs> yeah. watch the film. <laughs> uh, the film is going to be, uh, is going to have a, an online release. Okay. We are trying to to follow the, the the current trend of video on demand, which many people around the world can access. So you can watch the film from any device you you think of. Mm -hmm. any device that is available to you. Um, it's going to be available on Vimeo mm -hmm. to start with. So ha that's how we are making today the launch. So we are, we are doing a, 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 an online premiere, if, if I can say that. Um, yes, it's probably going to be on cinemas in the future. But as I say, uh, remember I told you I have six main roles and one supporting, well, again, I'm having first an online release and then the cinema. So if you go to see this film in cinema, uh, chances are that you have seen it already online, yes. which is good. So yes. it's a film that uh, is to enjoy. It's uh, my first feature film. We have more to come. And this one will be very accessible through uh, our website, which is fantasticapictures.co.uk. That's the website that you need to, to go. And to go and get the film from. Um, obviously, uh, we have a website for the film, which is playwithmemovie.com, uh, you can, where you can find all the behind the scenes uh, information, information about the characters, about the filmmakers, mm -hmm. the, the project in itself. Yes. But for the, the actual um, viewing of the film, you have to go to fantasticapictures.co.uk. And you pay there? You yes, we have a very affordable price for the film, uh, which is uh, uh, £3.99. Mm -hmm. It's something that you can pay, obviously, um, through PayPal. A very easy transaction on Vimeo. So it's, it's like, as it is happening with other video on demand pl platforms, you have your your credit or your um, money online and then you just simply pay and you have direct access to the film. It's mm -hmm. very, very easy. We are also promoting the, uh, the music score, which is music that was done by a um, um, good friend of mine. She's an accomplished musician. Uh, her name is uh, Boglarka Gerstner. 
Um, she's from uh, uh, she Colombia? Is, no, she's oh. from Europe, um, Hungary. Hungary. She's mm. a Hungarian musician, somebody who grew up playing the piano. Mm. So can you, can you imagine the, the type of music she, she made? Yes, she's, yes. She's, um, she did a really good, uh, really good music for the film. And that's how this film gets complemented. So it was not only us uh, with, the, with the camera and the actors shooting, it was the after, after what happens like with the editing, mm -hmm. with the music, mm -hmm. with the coloring, that this film got together and, and, and it's, a, it's a film to watch, it's a film to enjoy. Yeah. So, do you have any trailer to... Um, uh, I do have a trailer, yes. We, um, is it possible to um, yes. play it? If, you, if yeah. you go to, on our page on Facebook, you just need to type Fantastica Pictures and then you, you will find our page. Uh, and all the content about the film is there. We have been promoting uh, the film uh, for the last uh, month, and we, as per today, we have 3,500 followers, mm -hmm. which is in, in less than a month, uh, a month time. So it's a, it's a very fast-growing uh, community who are interested in the film, because we are simply promoting the film on the Fantastica Pictures uh, page and we already got this uh, amount of people asking for the film. So you have you find the trailer, mm -hmm. you find a preview for the music, and uh, you find promotional material behind the scenes information. Mm -hmm. If you go now, you will see how um, fans are reacting to to all this material, and you will see a lot of information from the actors, from us, mm -hmm. and from the story in itself. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to play the this. Uh short uh, trailer now and then we're going to come back and just uh, you know say a few more words yeah and um, then we're going to sit down and watch the film absolutely okay yes, absolutely Good all right let's welcome. go and see this trailer Mickey, I, I'm, I'm fixing the shelves La casa es muy grande. Lo para gente como nosotros. this is dj gold i thought my house was full of junk <laughs> Leave it! Mom is a single mother. Where, where's Lola? Trevor? Trevor? Ayúdame! Trevor! Lola! Maybe we can go? Come downstairs, we have that nice wine you like. Does Trevor live here? Yeah, please come in. I'm, I've just been asking the same question, Max, when I arrived. He promised me to take me to the airport. Oh, um... Please come downstairs, have a drink. What's this sound? So, um, all right, uh, let's uh, just talk about future plans. Uh, do you have anything in mind at the moment? You talk, you talk to me about you have another uh, project, which it was your first uh, script. What is this all about? Um, give us more information. Fantastica Pictures has uh, a slate of four films uh, that currently uh, wants to develop in the next five years. So, um, we have a, a, an upcoming project which is called Door 10. It's another psychological thriller. It's, 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 a, it's a bit more um, elaborated because there are different locations and, and we want to get uh, more actors involved. 
So it's going to be a major project. Mm -hmm. And then we have another film, uh, which is called Magnificent Trial, and uh, follows a, a story of a girl who dreams uh, a lot and enough to discover a fantastic place. But this is happening in the mountains of the Andes and in, in South America. Mm -hmm. So it's probably the Fantastica Pictures is going to South America in uh, maybe one, two years. It depends. But we are shooting a film in that we want to, to make this film. In the near future, yeah. Which is uh, the, the, the mm -hmm. script is, is, is uh, undergoing at uh -huh. the moment. Okay. Uh, but Door 10 is finished, is, is actually ready to start. And that's after this film that we are releasing today, Play With Me, we will start focusing on our attention on, on Door 10, which is going to mm -hmm. be another major film like uh, in London. It's okay. going to be a very interesting project. Lovely. Yeah. Okay, um, it was nice to have you here and uh, Thank learn you very about much. your, uh, you know, um, uh, coming here to London to fulfill your dreams, and uh, this is the start of it. And I'm, I'm going to wish you the best uh, with the release of the film today, and um, for your near future, you know, future plans. And yeah. um, what else can I say? Um, uh, good luck. Thank you everything. very much. Are you are you going to watch the film with Theo yes, Papavlos? Yes. With your friend? The, Theo, Theo Papavlos, yes. my friend, yes. Yeah. He's waiting for me, yeah. actually. He's, he's yeah. our associate, you know. He's, he's fantastic the one. He's, pictures, yeah. Associate. Is he? Should, yeah. He's you involved should, in that as well. Yeah. Yes. He hasn't watched the film. He hasn't, so but you're he's probably involved going to have in the, the, same, the, company as the well, same reaction. Yeah. 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 He well, hasn't I'm, seen it, but yeah. if, he's, if he watched it today, which I'm sure he will, you will have the same reaction. So it's a fair game. Yes. If you watch the film together. Well, he's waiting for me, you know, he, yeah. everything is set, you know, I mean, I think, you know, he's waiting, for, you know, for me to go and uh, meet him and uh, watch the film as well as, you know, I think he's cooking, you know, so we're going to have some... I think he's looking well. forward for the film as yes. well, yeah. Yes, and so lo look forward to meet uh, <laughs> everybody else. And um, anyway, thank you. And Thank um, you very much. I'm, I'm looking forward to have you here uh, talk Anytime. about the next film, you know. It, it was a privilege to be here. Thank yes. you very much, and I look forward to to be here again. Thanks. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well, that's it. This is what we have tonight for you, Mr. Uh, Mr. Jesse um, uh, Jimenez. It's a very different name. Jesse <laughs> Jimenez. 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 Yeah. Sorry about that. You know. That's <laughs> no, fine. Uh, thank you very much, and um, thank you. Uh, we see you again next week. Same time, same uh, program, might be with a different face or faces. Till then, look after yourselves and, you know, tell them, give them the information how they can watch the film again. If you want to be entertained today, go yeah. to fantasticapictures.co.uk and find the film Play With Me, which is just right at the top. And you can watch the film that we have made in two days. I hope you enjoy. Play with me and stay with me. Be with me next week. Same time, same place. Good night. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very much. Thank you.